Hey friends, what's up, Redneck Gamer here, welcome to The Beast Inside. First off, huge shout out to Playway for sending me this game early. This is the next upcoming horror game, it's a photorealistic horror game, uh, from what I understand. And I have played a little bit of it, but they've updated it several times since I played it. So I figured I'd go ahead and start from scratch. I do have a face cam up and running, but the key, if I press the key to bring that up right now, it'll start the game. And I don't want to do that quite yet because it'll be a cutscene. So you know. Anyways, I know I haven't don't do horror that much on my channel, and I hate that I don't. <laughs> I haven't done horror. <clears throat> Sorry about that. I haven't done horror since the end of October, beginning of November of last year. So let's just get into this. <laughs> I'm begging you, please, please, just leave me alone. What, what have I done to you? What, what, what do you want? Do you want money? You can have it. You can have it. You can have anything you want, please. I promise I won't tell anyone. You're wearing a mask. I, I don't even know what you look like. Please, please. My husband, Adam, he should be back any minute. No, no, no. What do you, what do you need an axe for? Please. I'm begging you. No, please. Adam! Adam, please help! Adam, help! Adam is gone. Oh, shit. Okay, looks like we're jumping right into this. One week earlier. So glad that we're getting away from the urban sprawl. Moving will make us feel better here. One day you'll thank me for that. I hope so. Just remember to fill up the car this time, Emma. I don't want to walk five miles to the nearest gas station again. Oh, sweetie. A little walk in some fresh mountain air would be good for you. <laughs> Plus, you could lose some weight. <laughs> I'm working on it. I'm working on it, okay? Look at him. We're finally here. Oh, it's wonderful. It's beautiful place. Indeed it is. Well, looks like the moving company got here before us. So, let's get to work. Alright, so let's get into this. So do I have a face cam? Those boxes inside, please. So sure you just thing, want us to move the bo boxes in inside the okay. car. I still walk around a little bit. Very nice game. It's running very well too. I do have to check one thing because I think blur. How about no? That's better. I hate the motion blur on uh, games. Right, Jeez. So. Continuing bringing these in. <sighs> yes, I'll bring it to the attic for you. Looks like I need something to pull down the stairs. Is that a cane? Uh pole hook for attic stairs, okay. Cool. Let me just do this. Ah. Oh cool, my body actually exists, that's good. It probably sounds really weird out of context. 
Locked. Hey, sweetie, do you have the key for this? Um, that's in the dining room. Dining room? Okay. I believe this is the dining room. Nope. Like that. Nope. Not here. Uh, um. Okay. I don't see it in the dining room. Oh, it's okay. not here. Right, I, I must have left it in the car. Okay. Where would you put them in the car? That's some that's some glowing over there, so let's go over there. Oh, that's cool. That's a little detail you probably wouldn't have ever expected to see, really. It is the key. Thank you. Ah, uh, there it is. All right, let's go ahead and go unlock the attic so we can put these boxes away. You know, it may seem silly. You know, you're in a horror game putting boxes away, but I think it's a really cool trick. It, like, it takes your mind off that it's not really a horror or that it's a horror game. Okay, let's put this box next to the others. Next to the others over here, I guess. But yeah, this this kind of aspect to it is like. I guess it kind of puts you at ease, if that makes sense, and helps you, it like desensitizes you. You know, in most horror games you go into it expecting to be scared. This one, you you go into it expecting to be scared, but then they throw something like this at you and you kind of get like, oh, okay, I I'm comfortable now. What's that? Let's see what we have here. Hmm, looks like I'm going to need a tool to pry this plank open. Tool to pry the plank open. Is that a tool? No, that's a broom. I need some coffee. Okay, tool. It's up here. Hey, look, a crowbar. That was easy. Please let it be money. Please let it be money. <laughs> That piece of wood actually knocked that chair over. That's so cool. Look at the detail on the wood. It's beautiful. Uh, that this is the one. Uh, okay. Not what I wanted to click on, but is it faith? Can I spell faith? The, the, yes! Awesome! Okay, now the stuff on top of it is what I wanted to look at. Oops. That's not what I wanted to do, but okay. Hmm. Let me go into my inventory. My, how do I go to my inventory again? Oh, tab, of course. Okay, so this one. Part of commentaries on the Gallic War, written by Julius Caesar. J. Julius Caesar initials, but why did he did someone write that they are equal? Beats me. Alright, so what's in here? We got a key. To something, we're not sure. And we got a diary, maybe? Property of Nicholas. 27th of September, 1864. Ooh, flashback. 27th of September, 1864. Mm. This place looks exactly like on the day I left it. So many years have passed away. Only the overwhelming silence helps me distinguish past from present. Maybe the best would be not to think about it. I better check if everything is in its own place. It is getting late. I should find some candles to light up while there's still some light. 
and told me that it would be a good idea to start writing down everything. So be it. They know better than I do. Chapter 2. Uninvited Guest. Sounds interesting. Alright, so now we're playing as Nicholas, from what I understand. And uh, let's get these matches up. Because we need to light the candles. It's really dark. I can barely see. There we are. Probably shouldn't light bows, but oh well. Look at that cute little statue of a possum thing. Probably the only time ever someone has ever said that. Kerosene. Oh, kerosene lamp. Ooh. Don't mind if I do. Oh, that's nice. That's a lot better. Now we can all see. Anything in there? Nope. And you? Ooh, kerosene. How about you? Nope. You? Nope. Okay. Well, this is in my way. Yeah. Yeah. There we are. Nothing seems to be of importance here, except those matches. Thank you. Ooh. Kerosene. Don't mind if I do. Okay, well we can't go out that way. That's locked. You have to go upstairs too. Nothing. Ooh, spoopy move music is coming in. This one all barricaded. It's weird. The hell, the hell was that? that? I think it came from upstairs. Okay, I was just up there. Damn, I thought that this one would have been fixed. Yeah, it was just locked. What the hell? <laughs> that was. Hey. Who the hell is that? Who's there? Why does he look like a scarecrow? Are you lost? Who the fuck is that? I don't know, but I don't think that's a who. who. I'm telling you what. Hey. Where'd you go? Creepy scarecrow dude, where'd you go? Hello? Anybody? Hope we didn't fall down that well. Check the area. Check the shed, okay. I guess this is the shed. There we are. And there we are. Kerosene, don't mind if I do. in here though. What's that? Oh. Some old newspaper rotate to find hidden message. Murder. The crime shocked the peaceful local community. The sheriff's deputy called to the end to confirm the death of the man. John Norton had been considered missing for the last weeks. The assailant assailant was exponentially brutal. The victim had a cut throat and discovered numerous cuts and burns were on the body, indicating long term torture. Well fuck that shit. What's that? Bolt cutters? I probably need those, right? It matches. I see you. Give me. Give me. Anybody else going? 
now. Okay. What the hell was that sound? Screw it. I better go back home. I'm going I'm home. Going the Wait, I am home. What the what hell? You? What are you doing in my house? my candles out. Spent a lot of time putting those in. Lit. I don't know where I was going with that. Oh, hell no. Kitchen. Really? Jesus Christ. Who the hell did we piss off? Fresh hell is this? And why do I keep pressing forward? Why am I going towards this? I could just walk out. You know, I could just turn around, walk out to the forest, and be happy. Instead, I'm about to do this. I guess. No, don't block the doorway, just lay down. This thing has to lay. Go out there. Yeah, sure, that works. It's a basement. It's a basement. I don't like basements. Oh, what the fuck? What the hell is going on here? What the hell is going on is correct. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. That horse scared the shit out of me. Yeah, fuck you. Not so much is down here, so that's good. Oh, kerosene. Jesus Christ, I'm scared now. Mm. Kerosene, please. Thank you. Do we have to go back up? I don't want to go back up. I need a lockpick. Follow the blood. <laughs> what? I don't want to do that. That's the last thing I want to do. Uh. Oh. I don't like this. Normally, when you crouch to go through stuff, you don't get back easily. Okay, okay, freaky ass painting. Let's do that. Oh no. Small pocket. Okay. Let me go ahead and do two more. So now we're back down to two kerosene. Hint. Get out of the basement. Don't mind if I do. I'd love to. Where the fuck am I? There we are. <laughs> the fuck? 
Well, I guess we know it's gonna be down here and not up there when we open the door, right? I guarantee you it's gonna be right outside of the fucking door. What the? I thought I found it in the pocket thing. Matches, please. I guess we have to go back because I didn't find the fucking mark pick. Well, thanks a lot. Is that really what I had to do? This game is too real. I don't like it. That's a lie. I love this game. This is a fucking amazing game. This scares the shit out of me. There we go. Oh. That was tricky. Yeah, it was pretty tricky. See, that's where the noise is coming from. I guess it's in the attic. No? Follow the. There's a blood trail again? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, it's not that one. No idea why I took it. Your father paid his debt. Now you will die. What the fuck is that? Oh, okay. <laughs> Coming 2019. That's an actually awesome game. Very awesome demo. That that demo is probably the perfect demo ever. It's the perfect amount of, you know, showing what the uh, game has to offer, what how good it's going to be, and it's just it's so good. I can't wait for the full game. It's going to be awesome. So, uh, yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, please like this, like, comment, subscribe. If you're not already subscribed, if you are already subscribed, click the bell icon so you're notified of when I upload in our stream. Uh, coffee burp, sorry. And until next time, I'm Gamer, and see you all in the next video. Bye bye.